In this video, I will demonstrate the power of Process Runner Excel add-in, showing how an end user can download data from SAP, modify the data, making appropriate changes, and then upload the new data back into SAP, all from an Excel spreadsheet without being required to navigate SAP screens. I'm going to go ahead and open up an Excel spreadsheet. You can see here that I have a list of GL accounts and corresponding company codes. And what I want to do is download data on these GL accounts and then modify the data, updating it, and then submit it to SAP, all without leaving this Excel spreadsheet. See here at the top, there's a Process Runner Excel add-in tab. I have process files located here. Extraction as well as update process files have been embedded in this Excel spreadsheet. And so the first thing that I want to do is extract appropriate data. So I'm going to select the extraction process file. And then I'll click on Run. And I'm now prompted to log into an SAP system in my SAP landscape. I'm going to go ahead and just log into this system. And now the uh, data is going to populate in the Excel spreadsheet. There's just a little run status on that extraction. If I scroll down here, you can see the message states that the data has been downloaded successfully. And over here, you can see the data that's populated now in this Excel spreadsheet. So I'm going to go ahead and just make a change to the field status group. I'm going to just going to change this to G011. And then I'll do the copy cell feature in Excel. Change this to copy cells and make that change. So now I've changed all of the, the field status groups on each of these GL accounts. So now I want to submit this new data into SAP. So from here I'm going to select the process file now, update. You can see that this is uh, both for the transaction, both of these are for the transaction code FS00, the SAP transaction code. Select update there. Now I'll run this. Again, prompted for a logon credentials. I'm just going to minimize our run status bar there. So you can see here it says the data was saved. And I'm just going to select this last row here. I'm going to scroll over. From here you can see that that last row is the GL account number 176800. And I just want to verify that the field status group has been changed to G011. You'll notice that the cell that I selected does have a formula inside of it. And this is a hyperlink that I created when the process file was created in Process Runner. So I'm going to click on the Show in SAP GUI. From here, I'm taken to that GL account 176800. I'm going to go to this Create Bank Interest tab. And you can see here that it states that the field status group is now G011, exactly what we changed it to. So this was a, just a quick demonstration of the power of Process Runner Excel add-in, how you can embed process files inside of an Excel spreadsheet. An end user could upload download data to and from SAP, all without being required to navigate SAP views. If you would like more information on Process Runner or other products that Inaware has developed for integrating SAP with things such as your SharePoint application, your databases, please see our website at inaware.com.